Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm a trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of US oil for Monday. If you're watching my videos for the first time, you can subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis. So let's get started. So my dear friends, this is the daily chart of US oil. And if you love to trade on oil, then you must be knowing that overall the market was an uptrend. But yesterday or on Friday, market showed great amount of weakness and market ultimately closed around 76.54 so you can see that the resistance level that we have been talking about that worked and the main reason is the ongoing market situation crude futures settled lower on market concerns crude prices slump on chinese energy demand concerns crude oil and gasoline prices on friday retweeted on concern about chinese energy demand Crude was also under pressure from signs that Israel will join peace talks in Paris on the Hamas war, which could reduce some geopolitical risk. For the last couple of days, because of the ongoing Middle East tension, crude was in uptrend. And you can see that there is a possibility of a peace and because of the demand, okay, right now crude is showing that, okay, finally I'm ready to go down. So this is the ongoing market sentiment. So if you are holding a sell position on US soil, then I think that you can hold your position because further downside is very much possible. And if we look at the trend of the market here, then my dear friends, let's look at the trend on the daily first. So on daily market was in downtrend, market tried to recover. But in comparison to the fall, you can see the rise or the recovery was quite slow. The recovery wa uh, was lacking buying power and because of which we can expect that further downside may also come. Okay. And after two or three days, maybe we will get a clear picture regarding the trend of the market. But as of now, things are not very positive. So the trading opportunities that are in front of are mostly for day traders only because if you're a swing trader or a position trader, then you need to wait for one or two days so that you can get a clear picture about the next trend of the market. Okay. The first level in front of us is 75.68 to 75.38. Let me write it down. 75.68 to 70 sorry 75.38 this is the first level on the chart of gold where we can expect the market to bounce as a day trader because you can see markets that can support previously around this area and the 200 moving average will also be present so as a day trader at least we can expect a bounce but the market sentiment is above all right after the market opening if you see that the selling pressure is extremely high then continue with the sell position but on the other hand, if you see that the selling pressure has reduced, market is showing small, small candles near the support, then as a day trader, obviously you can look for a buy, isn't it? And here is our beloved FIBO, and we can see that after the support of 75.6838, we have the next support around 74.80. Why 74.80? Because we can see our FIBO 23.6% retracement level has done a nice job. And at the same level, market close also. So the second FIBO level, which is 70, uh, sorry, 38.2%, 38, uh, is at 74.8. And if the selling price is not very high, we can expect a bounce. If not a complete trend reversal, at least we can expect a quick, uh, some quick profit around 74.80. If market takes support and bounces, we can definitely hit the buy button. And we can stay on the trade till 75.40 75.50 means this level will be our resistance or this will be our target okay so these are the two trading opportunities if we see market going down where as a day trader we can look for a buy but on the other hand if we see market going up right after the market opening then due to the ongoing market sentiment there is a good chance that as a day trader we can uh, make some money by taking a sell as well because on the hourly chart, see, I have changed the time frame. I'm in a one hour time frame. So on the hourly chart, we can clearly see the trend of the market is down. Sellers are dominating and respecting the trend of the market. What should we do? We should look for sell on rise. And where we can look for a sell on rise? 
the first level is around 77.30 and the seven, second level is 77.60. These are the two levels where we can look for a sell if you see the market is going up. Listen to me carefully. Okay, do not trade blindly. If you see the market is showing recovery, but it should not be too bullish because see, there is a there is a difference between retracement and recovery. If you see the market is standing at the level with a big green candle, then obviously market is bullish. You should avoid selling. But if you see the market is showing small small candles, market is showing price rejection from above. You'll get the confirmation that okay, sellers are still dominating. In that case, you can look for a sell around 77.30 to 77.60. The first level 77.30 because you can see the previous support will be working as resistance. And 77.60 because of previous price rejection around this area as well as the 200 moving average is also present as dynamic resistance. And if we add the flavor of FIBO here, then you can see we also have the FIBO 38.2% retracement level here. And here we have FIBO 50% retracement level. And if we combine all the factors, then these two levels seem to be good one. We also have immediate resistance from FIBO around 77.9, sorry, 76.9. 76.9 is the first level, but right after the market opening, uh, market may be too volatile, so I'm avoiding it. But if you are a risk taker, if risk is your middle name, you can also look for a sell around this area as well. But I will say that you can look for a sell around these areas uh, if market reverses. And if you're a swing trader, position trader, then as I said, you can avoid uh, position right now. Let the market give you a particular direction. Anyways, my dear friends, I hope you guys are enjoying my analysis on US oil that I have started recently. If I'm missing out anything, please write down in the comment section. I would love to learn. And you must be knowing that I conduct a workshop three to three to four times a year max and the world's most affordable forex trading workshop yeah it is back again so if you're interested you can be a part of it this workshop is not for complete beginners i have designed a workshop only for those people who have been struggling with the market unable to make money for months and years and i have kept it very affordable so that people from all around the world can afford i have also shared my story so that you can understand that nothing is impossible in the market and you can see these are the topics that we will be discussing in the three days but three days is not enough so three days workshop plus one month support and in the one month support you can see that you will be having um, weekly lessons so that you can okay be in touch with the learning stuff and on day-to-day -day basis you will be receiving regular updates about the market on whatsapp we also have a community so that you can interact with traders from all around the world this is a glimpse of the WhatsApp group where you will be receiving regular market updates and analysis. And this is how our community on Telegram looks like, my dear friends. You can see the dates are 1st, 2nd and 3rd of March. And Hindi classes 9, 10 and 11th of March. You can join now also. You will be receiving free updates till the workshop. No need to worry. And you can see 3 days workshop with 1 month support is only $15 or so rupees 1000 for Indians. And these are the benefits that you will be receiving. And you can see for semi-annual, okay, semi-annual, it's only $65 with rupees 4,000. And you will also be getting two personal sessions with me to clear doubts, for um, to ask questions. And if you like my work, okay, if you want to stay in touch with me, then you can see, my dear friends, it's only $125 or rupees, rupees 8,000 for lifetime support. And here you'll be receiving six personal sessions with me to for learning to clear doubts etc etc and all the payment methods are mentioned on the website once you're done with the payment just share the screenshot to this whatsapp number so that i can add you and you can also share the screenshot of the payment to this email here along with your whatsapp so that i can add you thank you so much